What's going on guys, it's Grizzly here and today I'm giving you guys a couple tips and tricks on how to get nuclears. Let's get right into it. So guys, my top these are my top five ways to help you guys uh help you guys get towards those nuclears. If you guys haven't got one and you want to get that dark uh dark op challenge, or if you guys just want to get nuclears and get sick gameplays and just all that stuff, I'll be giving you five ways to do that. But before I get into these five tips, I gotta tell you guys about my gameplay in the background. Of course, it's a nuclear, and not that bad that I can't even get a nuclear for the for the how to get a nuclear video. It's uh, playing on the map Skyjacked. I'm using the exact class setup that I used in my last video um, for the VMP best class setup. That video got lots of views. It got I think almost a hundred views. That's absolutely insane. So that'd be that'd be awesome if you guys could uh, just like like this video and just support my channel a little bit as I'm trying to grow. So tip number one is use a gun that works for your playstyle. This is, uh, people might be like, oh, that's obvious, like, skip to the next tip. But really, this tip is pretty important. You can't just use guns that everyone else is using or guns that people say are amazing or you get killed by a bunch of times, because that gun may not work for you. It's like, like, for me, I get killed by, like, the XR2 a lot, but I'm terrible at the XR2 for whatever reason. I just not go with it. My favorite gun is the VMP. And if you guys love the VMP, you can check out my best class setup video because I have the best class what in this game, I think, for the VMP. And it works perfectly for me, but it may not work perfectly. Perf wow, I can't talk today. Perfectly for you. Tip number two is use cover. This is another pretty obvious one, but it helps you a lot. Don't just rush blindlessly into the spawn, even if you're using an SMG like the Vesper, the VMP, or... Even the Kuda, some guns that like just melt, be like, oh, I'm gonna win gunfights anyways, use cover. And just like, move slow, move cover to cover, and uh, it'll help you win a lot of those gun battles. And uh, mainly, use those covers to head glitch, if you don't know what head glitching is. Basically, when you're behind an uh, object, like a box or something, and only your head's showing to the enemy, but for you, you can see them through your gun. Tip number three is pre-aim and pre-fire. This is a pretty important tip. Uh, that lots of people don't use it, actually. Uh, when you're going around corners, don't sprint around corners. Go slow around the corners and uh, have your have your sights up. And so if somebody pops around that corner, you can shoot them. And uh, my tip is have have your like sights aimed a little before the doorway. So if they come around, you already have that little advantage on them. And if you know somebody's around the corner, shoot and then go around the corner. Uh, it just helps you get that first shot if you know somebody's there. Tip number four, use the right score streaks. If you're going for a nuclear, uh, you're not going to want to use the Wraith, the Raps, and I don't know, maybe the Mothership. The Wraith and the Raps, you could use for a nuclear, uh, but you you want something that isn't going to get kills for you. You want something that's going to help you out. So like the UAV, the counter UAV, the Hater. The Hater is probably the most important one for getting nuclears. Uh, maybe even the Power Core or Hardened Sentry and Guardian could also be used if you just put it up somewhere to like kind of funnel enemies towards you. And my fifth and final tip is use game modes with good spawns. And by good spawns, I mean predictable spawns. It doesn't have to be perfect. Like, even free-for-all you can do if you know the spawns well, but you're not going to hop into your very first free-for-all game and get a nuclear unless you're, like, amazing at Call of Duty. Like, Optic Scumpy or somebody. Like, insane, just first game on. Uh, but, like, Uplink, um, Domination... Uh, basically, uplink domination, capture the flag, demolition, basically anything with good spawns. But I would stay, try to stay away from team deathmatch, uh, kill confirmed. You can play hardpoint if you're playing with a team that's actually good and like you know will control the spawns. But if you're playing with randoms, hardpoint isn't the best because spawns can flip pretty easy and you'll get shot in the back. So if you guys did enjoy that uh, top five tips on how to get a nuclear. Uh, please do like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.